You a bad shawty, yeah. please don't waste my time yeah. so on my neck, I think you're drinking too much wine Bad ho, call me up, she wanna be mine Okay, like bad, pullin' up yeah. <laughs> So today, we playing the most deep indie game I think I've ever played You know, it start off innocent, you like, oh, this pretty smooth And then bam, it hits you So, let's go Bad parenting. Story one. Mr. Redface. Mama, mama. Son, mom, you're home late again. Come on, I was busy with work. Can you have some sympathy for me? But today is my birthday. Oh, whoa, where's my presents, Mom? Oh, oh, of course, I know that. Then where's my gift? You didn't get your son a gift? Mama, I can't get no gift. Have you ever heard of Mr. Redface? On the birthday of good children, Mr. Redface secretly leaves gifts while they're asleep. Really? Of course. If you want to get your gift, you have to go to bed right away. Oh my god, you're a horrible mother. I'm going to bed right now, Mom. Who the hell? Dad, you're fooling the kid again. How many times have you come home this late? Oh, GG. I was working in my shift and did late. Bullshit. You still think I'm an idiot, don't you? Hey, little shit. Get back to your room. Look, it's my birthday, bruh. Or am I? Who am I? Am I the kid? Don't stand here eavesdropping on grown up conversations. It's my birthday, dad. So I'm not gonna get no love on my birthday. I'm just gonna get sent to my room. And my, you think my mama having an affair? Y'all didn't give me no presents. Y'all didn't give me no love, no attention. I just gotta go to sleep for. I gotta go to sleep for my birthday, bro. All right, cool then. This, this is why kids grow up with resentment. Where's my bed? No, a, a roof over my head is not enough love for me. I need, I need attention and gifts. I'm a, I'm a son, bro. My bed don't even have a frame. I sleep on the floor. Turn the TV on, bro. Not, not going to sleep. Now, mama, when I wake up, there better be a gift right here at my the foot of my bed. Who's that? Wait, Mr. Redface actually exists. Now let's my mom transform. Hey, well, Mr. Redface, you the only one who cared to give me a gift, so appreciate you, big dog. I'm gonna love you more than my mama. Where my gift at? Oh. Hey, shout out Mr. Redface. Is that the gift from Mr. Redface? No way. Shout out Mr. Redface, the only nigga who care about me in this household. Hi, I'm Ron. What, you can talk? Of course, because I was created by magic. You even have the same name and appearance as me. That's right, my master made me just for you. But your neck seems a bit loose. It's okay. Sometimes my master makes mistakes. This is just a small flaw compared to the other dolls. What's important is that from now on, I'll be your best friend. That 
That sounds wonderful. You want to play something with me? Mm, my master stored my toys in the closet. Wait, your toys? You the dog? Can you get them for me? Wait, you the dog, gang? I'm the I'm the human. You don't have toys. The closet is still stuck. Can you try that again? What the hell did this nigga put in my closet? I've tried my best and I can't open it. You want me to do something else? I'm hungry. Bro, you're a dog. Can you even eat? No, you'll be the one eating, but I'll be able to feel everything that you eat. My master linked all your senses and emotions to me so I can easily understand you. Wow, that's amazing. So if you hungry, I'm hungry. So just like a um it's like an Apple Watch before Apple Watch got created. It's like Life 360. Not a bad thing. Ah, oh, dad left his fucking pills on the table. There go mom wine. He's always drinking. You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you? Aren't you sleepyhead? I prepared your favorite dish in the fridge, so remember to heat it up before eating. Lately, I've noticed you've been getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home, so please learn to take care of yourself and stop making me worry. One more thing, don't forget to take your medicine after eating. Mom, yo, am I, I'm barely taller than the stove and they got me at home by myself. This is Des, the, the name of the game, bad parenting, bro. You were holding something else. Put this little ass doll down. Excuse me. Thank you, Mama. My favorite meal is spaghetti in real life, too. How did you know that, Mama? You're gonna eat now, Mama. You're in my seat. I'm trying to eat. How do I eat? Oh, maybe I. Oh, I gotta microwave that. You okay, buddy? Alright. Let's chow now. Is that your favorite dish? Do you want to see me perform some magic? Yeah. Yes, please. All right. I'll make this plate of food never run out. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. The hell? Show me this. Okay. Wow. That's amazing. What else can you do? Interesting. It's probably not good for health to be doing that. No, I, I'm not. I'm too young for that, bro. I'm too young for that. I'm not trying to drink. No, I'm too young for that. Put the bottle down. God damn. <laughs> What just happened? I don't know. You guess. You just got drunk? I don't know. The bottle. My dad's going to whip my ass. I hope he's still asleep. Your dad? Don't worry. My master has taken your dad away. What? What did you say? Oh, no. So I got a stay-at-home dad, and then now he's also a stay-at-home dad that's missing? How did this nigga teleport? Where's my dad? As I said, my master has taken your dad away. Why? Because your dad is a bad person. He's often hits you. Wait, hits and yells at you. Parents like that are taken away by my master to protect children like you. Oh. So it's a it's a good game. It's just guy CPS. But this is too much. My dad doesn't deserve that. He's a bad person. No, he's not. Please let my dad go. I'm begging you. All right, all right, but my master won't like this. It's quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. Show me the way. Bro, I'm a little ass boy. Shortcut is through your closet. I'm a little ass boy. I'm not trying to go on a mission. Why do mom and dad sleep in separate beds? Sleep on different twin size beds, bro. You still can't open it? 
<gasps> I forgot to take my medicine. That's a disappointment. I guess we'll have to use your parents' closet then. I forgot to take my medicine, y'all. My mom said I'm supposed to take my medicine after eating. My mom gonna stay at home. She's gonna stay at work late tonight. I can't take my medicine, bro. Why, why are they married with separate breads? I was just about to say that. Them kids, maybe they have like a... Maybe the dad snore too loud or something. Or like, shit. Or his meat too big and it just take up too much of the bed. Uh, you should know that these closets can function as portals. They can take you anywhere you want, including where your dad is being held. Give it a try. This game is, is Narnia influenced. There's nothing in here. Oh, right. I forgot. There are a few steps you need to take to activate this shortcut. Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. Yo, is this little dude leading me on, bruh? What the hell am I playing, bro? This radio will work like an elevator button. You need to select a frequency first. If you choose the right frequency, the door will open to the place you need to go. Hmm, okay. Seems like that's not it. Let's try again. Hey. Is it the ocean? What the hell is that? Is that my mom? The hell is that? You not gonna say nothing? It's a body in the closet. I think this is the one. Go ahead and step in. I'll stay here and watch the house. Dad? Dad, are you out there? I miss you, Dad. Dad, Dad? It's been so long since I've seen you. Dad, is that you? What's up? I'm looking for my dad. Describe. My dad's name is Bruce. <laughs> Wait a moment. Hmm. There are many Bruce's here. Any more details? Uh, drop them off. Is this Bruce a good Bruce or bad Bruce? Uh, bad Bruce. Well, my dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. So he's a bad Bruce. Let me see. There are still many bad Bruce's. More specifics, please. What else does he do? He often yells. He's a stay-at-home dad. And he thinks my mom is cheating. Still not enough information. Sometimes he hits me. And slaps too. And that's all. The door is behind you. You know my dad off just that. Oh. Ha ha. He just got startled. Who are you guys? Just like you, we're kids on our way to find our parents. We're staying here for a bit. You want to join us? Hey, I'm good, y'all. I, I know where my dad is. Yeah, I'm, I'm out of here. Y'all can sit here waiting for your parents to slide. This is the problem with a lot of parents that they didn't teach their son to go out and get it. This is why I told y'all y'all need to listen to Rod Wave because he's going to teach you to go out and get it. See, these is probably Billy Eyelash listeners. So they just sit there waiting for the birds of the feathers to flock together. No, we're going to go hustle. I'm out of there. Dad? Please stop punishing me. It's me, Dad. Please stop punishing me. What has he done to you? Come on, let's go home. Or Mr. Redface will take both of us. Please stop punishing me. 
hey, he getting what he did to me. You you want to hit your kids? You want to put your hands on me as your son? Okay, Mr. Redface going to put his hands on you. I don't see nothing wrong with this. Dad, come on. Get up, nigga. Cut the act out, bro. Spell. <laughs> Johnny woke up, I guess. Hey, Mom. 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 Hey, what's wrong with you? Why are you hiding in the closet? Mr. Redface is taking Dad. Oh. Whoa, that's a good thing then. What? I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How is your doll Ron doing today? Is it all right? How do my mom know about the doll? The doll? Mom, how do you know about it? Of course I know, since you haven't taken your medicine today. Huh? This isn't the first time you've had such hallucinations. Every time you tell a different story, but the common factor is always that stupid doll. Don't you remember the previous times? No. So that's why I'm taking medicine. I got hallucination problems, so none of this is real. I don't know what is wrong with you. Just go to bed. It's midnight already. Yeah, I feel like I'm probably like five, six years old. Am, am I really to be eternally placed on these medications to help me at five, six years old? The hell? The hell? What just happened, son? Are you all right? Come on, pass me, pass me the the, per the medicine at this point, cause I'm not. I'm confused, my damn self. Ooh, I get to sleep in that that bed. You feel better now? Yeah, mom. It's Mr. Red. It's all right. Tomorrow I'll take a day off to stay home and take care of you. Really? Promise me, Mom. I promise. Now go back to sleep. Yes, Mom. Can we get back to on the topic of me not getting a single gift for my birthday and I'm a little ass boy? Like, these are childhood memories that stick with you forever. And you as a mother, you... Mom? That doll was not the present. That's a part of my imagination that I need my medicine for. Sai, you broken the promise again. You're a horrible mother. Red face need to take you next. Let's see that punishment he gonna give you. I keep getting punished with bad parents. Give me, please give me my medicine, bro. I might need some water with my medicine, bro. Dumbass doll. <gasps> What happened to you? Yo, did my doll... My master beat the shit out of me. <laughs> okay. My doll got the shit beat out of him. He wasn't happy about what happened yesterday. I'm sorry, this is my fault. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? My master has taken... No! What? It just happened. I'm sorry, I couldn't stop him. You should run away because he'll come back soon to take you too. No! No, I have to say my mom and my dad too. How? Don't you see what he did to me? Bro, you was, you was a dog, Goofy. I could fix you up easily. Come on, man. What that is? I found this at my dad's prison. I think it might help us defeat him. That, 
cast a spell to defeat Mr. Redface. Come on. Quickly go into the closet where you could where your mom is being held. Uh let me go in the closet. I so now I'm a superhero baby. After the fact that my mom got taken, then my dad, I mean, my dad got taken, then my mom got taken, then the baby got the shit beat out of him. And I just got the spell in my back pocket. What did my mom do to get took? Like, she was a bad mom in the sense that she forgot about me. But, like, did she really have to warn and get took? Look, y'all Billy Eyelash listeners still ain't find y'all parents. I'm out here. I'm grinding for mine. the Rod Wave listener. I'm here. Quickly, throw that spell in here and take cover. It's a grenade. Ma, that thing cooking. Ma, that grenade is cooked. Ma, get down. Keep listening to Billy. That's why you don't got no parents. Your parents ain't never coming back. Y'all too busy looking for the birds. Come on, let's get in there. Let's see the aftermath. Mama? Mama? What's happening to you? My master has been defeated. The magic he cast on me is also fading. Are you disappearing? Don't worry. This is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. Let's go. Simple. I'm a hero. Dad. Oh, dad, mom. Is they still in that argument? Dad, mom. Y'all are free now. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. You been having an affair. How you? Hey, don't, don't put your, your hands on my mama. I told you I was busy with work. Liar. You neglected this family for another man? Aren't you the same to lie to your son? And what about you? Do you think you're better than me? You're just at home leeching off me all year round. What kind of father are you? Yeah, you ain't no provider. No matter what I do, it's my business. I still bring money home to support my child. And if you still think I'm a whore, you're lowering yourself even below that. One more word. Fine. You and I get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. If you're still here tomorrow, I'll take my son and leave. You stay right there. Ma, no, ma. Ma, have him lead, ma. Ma, have him lead. Don't leave me here with him. Ma, he put your, his hands on you. No, he about to start drinking, bruh. Red face knew he was a pre-shadowing. He was a foreshadowing. Eat a red face because he's drinking. You don't ever show me no love, dad. And you have a hairline with no head, with no hair. It don't make no sense. It was him drinking, not red face. It's him. My abusive father. I won't let this happen. And that's when he beat me. No. It's displaying everything he did to the doll he really did to me. He's beating me. Ma, 
come home, please. Kill me. No, no, no. This cannot be true. I'm dead. I'm literally dead. I'm very sorry, Ron. The closet. I think you're able to open it now. All they did was display. This whole time, it was just a display of the red face is actually my dad and how my dad abused me, bro. I'm dead. It's me. This is me? I do not know anything about these. You've always known. Because I'm the knowing part of you. You tried to deny and reject these things and made up stories to make yourself feel better about you and your dad. And me, I have to find a way to lead you back to reality. I tried many times, many ways to help you accept this truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, guess what happens? Tick tock, boom. All the memories disappear. You once again wake up at the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? 14 days. Can't have been that long. What really happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap motel room. Yo, this is all mind. This is all a mind game, bro. Where's my mom? That's him in the motel room. Is he? He's shivering from that guilt. He killed his son. Go home with me, dad. I'm haunting that nigga. Hell yeah. Please stop punishing me. Yeah, that's that guilt, boy. What about my mom? She still sees me, doesn't she? Yo, and when I had threw that grenade in there, that was my mom. That was my, that was my mother grieving, bro. That's right, because she's only home late at night. But if it's daytime, where my mama at? Son? See, this is why I threw the grenade. And the kids that was outside, the Billy Eyelash listeners, they was the kids in heaven, bro. Do you have any clues about your husband's hiding place? Drop something, ma'am. What is that? What is that? Oh, wait. This is what the sun threw in the room. This is what we just did in heaven. It wasn't really a grenade. It's my social security. It's a motel card. I threw the motel card in there. But I'm not sure it's mine. I threw that in there from heaven. I threw that from heaven. This was all. I'm 
understanding, bro. It's, it's called bad parenting. One, you have an abusive father, but the mom was away so much that she couldn't stop her child from being abused because she had to work so much. So in, in just like a wreck, it's not her, it's like her fault, but like she just on top of it makes her a bad parent too, even though she don't mean to be a bad parent, but just because she was working so much. Could have helped. Those are all kids that's suffering from bad parenting. This game got meaning to it. It's all connecting in my brain. The red face was the dad. That's why the doll said the red face beat the shit out of him. Oh, this is play with my mind. Wow. Wow. Hey, good game, bro. Nah, that's deep. That's deep. That's actually deep, bro. That's actually deep. I gotta look at the reviews of this game.